Now here I am trying to get this thing to load properly again and I made a new boot disk kit out of this Windows 98 machine. So now I got the device drivers needed and stuff but I still can't get the CD-ROM to detect properly on the DOS. Even though it does load fine properly on Windows 98. And I'm able to use the CD-ROM and stuff. So let's boot this up and I'll show you what I mean. Part. It's connected and on, but it's not detecting it. And the driver is right there. So the configuration says for me to configure as PCMCIA CD. So I don't get it. What the hell is going on here? I'm showing a floppy, which is testing. And yeah, I made a RAM disk so that I could just eject the RAM out of it. Anyways, let's go here. So you guys can have a look at my config that says. And then my auto exec that bat. Whoops, that's it wrong. There we go. And here what the manual says for me to do. Which I already did the instructions as it should. And it's KME CD that says, which is a driver for this one apparently. And it's asking me to type it as PCMCIA CD, which I did exactly here, but it's not finding it. And I know it's connected properly and secure, so I don't get it. And I already just did this. Now if I use ASPI 365.sys, the system will hang. And I have a 
it's set properly, pretty much. So I don't get it. So I can use a little help here, anybody, so I can get Windows 95 to install on this PC. And before anybody asks about using the floppy edition, I have OnTrack Disk Manager with the DDO installed on this hard drive, which is a 20 gigabyte IBM Travel Star. The BIOS on this one officially supports up to 4 gigabytes, surprisingly, but the nature of Windows 3.1 and and Windows 95 before OSR 2.5 can only do FAT16 and and this so-called C edition actually does support FAT32 which is what I'm using so the floppy installer isn't really a viable solution for me unfortunately so if anybody can help me get this thing running so I can install Windows 95 Please uh, drop a comment and thanks for watching.